Okay, today uh, we're working on the furnace from my motor home. When I bought it, the fellow told me that the furnace doesn't work, that he didn't know why. They're real easy to pull out. Um, basically, you just remove one screw here at the base and slide it out of a compartment. It's kind of like a line replaceable unit. So I brought it in and uh, basically ohmed out everything, checked everything that I can. The blower works fine. This is the nozzle right here that goes into the combustion chamber. Okay, this is the, the solenoid valve that opens up to allow gas into the combustion chamber. Blower motor, <clears throat> really good wiring diagram. All the manuals are available online, factory manuals. Okay, right here is the control board. So it checks out good. So what I've done is I've made a, a test bed for it where I've taken the cannon plug. It's pretty simple, this system. Um, four wires, negative, positive for the motor, the control board, the solenoid valve. And then the black wire that goes to the two blue, those are actually your thermostat circuit. So I've shorted those two together so that it, it thinks... Um, that the thermostat has been activated. So the uh, I took the nozzle out and cleaned it because what's up, Nemo? <clears throat> because I I couldn't figure. I'm like, how am I going to check this solenoid valve? Because this pressure in this system is only one psi or less. So I had to use something that was pretty low pressure that I could visually see that I'm getting flow through the nozzle and through the valve. I thought about it for a while, and I'm like, well, I need an accumulator. So I asked my wife where the party balloons are. I've inflated this. I've already tried it. Um, at first, after the 15-second purge cycle, it would deflate, but not very rapidly. Like there wasn't enough flow. <clears throat> so I took the nozzle out, and I did find it obstructed, which is really usual for a propane system. So right now what we're going to do is activate this from a battery. Don't use a battery charge or anything because if the voltage fluctuates on it, you're going to burn out the circuit board. So after the 15-second stage, um, for purging, that valve should open and this balloon should deflate, theoretically. You'll be able to hear a click of the ignition. Garage and fire it up, see what happens. 